Hi guys, welcome back to Stella Zone. I trust that you guys are doing wonderful. Today's recipe is going to be really quick and simple. So I'm making this recipe for for everyone that is um, African and still want to enjoy Ghana food but wants to lose weight. So I'm going to be making fufu, okay? And these are my ingredients that I'm going to use. I have spinach, okay, organic spinach. I have one cup of fufu flour here. I have two cups of water. So what um, I'm going to do. All right, so I'm taking a handful of spinach, okay, and then I'm going to add just a little more about that, okay, you can do two cups of spinach if you want. I'm going to add some water to blend, and then I'm going to blend. my pot that I'm going to be cooking the fufu in and I have a wooden spoon like benkuta or a wooden ladle or ladle or ladle whatever you want to use just um that and I'm pouring my fufu in here my one cup of fufu in here in the pot and then I'm going to be adding the spinach and I'm going to stir okay I'm sort of like mixing it in so I'm just gonna do this onto the fufu and the spinach is like mixed I'm going to rinse out the blender with, with the remaining of the water. Remember, we started with two cups of water. So, so basically, that's all. Our powdered fufu and the blended spinach is well mixed, okay? The reason why I did not put... You can go ahead and put the fufu um, with the spinach and blend it. But I feel like it will thicken up in the blender until you might end up needing more than two cups of water. That's why I did the method that I did. But you can add it to the spinach um, in the blender and then blend it all together. You might just have to add a little bit extra water to, like, you know, rinse out your blender when you do that. So this is going to go on the stove and this is going to cook until it forms into a nice um, dough texture um, until the color changes and then you know it's ready okay all right let's go so as you can see our fufu is starting to form okay so we'll still have some a bit of time left um, to go so just keep staring okay it is it is very hard for um powdered fufu like this to get lumpy so don't worry about it just keep staring and just smash it against the pot okay to get rid of every lumps in there so you can see it's forming very nice nicely ladies and gentlemen look at how beautiful nice this fufu looks I am telling you, all right, this is going to fill you up much um, quicker so you don't end up eating um, a lot of the fufu if you're trying to lose weight. Now, um, for the spinach, you can do a mixture, you know. You can do a mixture of spinach and broccoli. Mm -hmm. You can do cabbage. You can do carrots. Just, you know, just run wild with your imagination. You, you can even do a mixture of spinach and kale, or you can do just kale. So like I was saying, you can do a mixture, okay, of the vegetables. You can mix and match the vegetables and then add your fufu powder to it. I ended up using a quarter cup more water. So it was two and a quarter cup of water um, that I used. And this is almost ready. I will go ahead and give it um, five more minutes, making it like a total of 15 minutes um, to cook this uh, delicious uh, spinach fufu. Our fufu is ready, okay? So this is the spinach fufu. This will keep you full. This is nice and um, a way of introducing some greens also into your fufu, okay? All right, so I hope you like this video. If you have any questions, uh, let me know. Okay, so those, this took me about 12 minutes to cook, okay? Um, you don't have to cook it for 15 minutes. 12 is fine. So like, comment, share, subscribe if you have any more ideas or if you have any other recipes you want me to make, just leave them in the comment section until I come your way again. Remain in God and have a great day, guys. Bye. Subscribe. Okay, subscribe.